Welcome to Doc Pedigree Manager video tutorials. In this video, I'm going to show you how front-end users can add and edit doc profiles and also upload photos. So for that, uh, the user will have to be logged in. As you can see, I am already logged in as the administrator, and we have to go to the My Docs layout. So let's go there. So as you can see in this layout, uh, there will be a list of all the docs that the user have entered. I have entered all these docs, so uh, it is all listed under my account. Next, uh, you have the action area. Uh, here, you can click on the. Uh, this is the profile button. If you click this, this will take you to the profile. And next, there is the gallery button to jump into directly into the docs gallery. And next, there is the edit button. Okay, let's click on this to edit a doc profile. So let's edit beer girl. So this is the page for editing dogs. This is the edit dog layout. As you can see, there is a form uh, with all the dogs information: uh, dog name, date of birth, registration number, father, mother, uh, published order, and the dog profile information. Everything. And uh, at the bottom, as you can see, there is a submit button. If you click this button, this will update all the information. Okay. So let's click it, edit again the father and the mother fields were a select box before well, we have changed that uh, because of some people have a lot of dogs in their uh, database like uh, 40,000 or 50,000 dogs so a select box will be very inconvenient here okay that will be a very very long list and it will be very difficult to select uh, the particular dog so we have come up with this uh, new feature okay this new selection box let's click on it and a dialog will appear and inside you will be able to see all the male dogs for dog father and uh, this is paginated okay you can select the number of dogs you want to see per page and you can also search a dog uh, using the alphabets so if you want to find the dogs starting with a C then you click on C and the list of dogs will appear uh, this C has no dogs here, so let's try something else. Let's try F. Okay, as you can see, the dogs uh, with name is starting with F are listed here, and you just uh, need to click on the dog name, and it will be set as the dog father. As uh, simple as that. Okay, next there is the upload photo step, and here you can uh, see the dog. You can update the dog. Uh, profile photo and you can also be able to add new photos to the gallery okay you have to set the title order published and choose the photo and when you are done uh, just click the submit button here and it will automatically upload the photos okay so that's it about editing dogs and uh, similarly you can go to the add dog layout okay to add a new doc profile and it is uh, exactly same as the edit doc profile form as you can see the dog name select the dog father select the mother and and all the other information and when you are done uh, just click the submit button and the doc profile will be saved then you can go to the upload photos and select the profile photo and if you have a uh, gallery pictures uh, you can upload them to the gallery and click the submit button again and it will upload all the photos so uh, th this is very simple okay and uh, let me show you how you can link to these pages from the admin menu okay let's go to the admin area so let's go to the main menu that's the top menu this is the top menu and I have uh, added the my dogs and add dog layout under my account so here they are as you can see you cannot directly uh, link to an edit doc profile you have to link to the my dogs profile okay so it's very simple
to select a link to the my docs you can uh, directly do it from the menu uh, for let me show you let's change the menu type and you'll see here you will see the doc pedigree management tree and here is my dog and here is my dogs under my dogs here yeah, this is the layout you want to link to so that's pretty much all about uh, adding and editing talk profiles uh, in the front end and uh, these options uh, these uh, menu items uh, does not have any parameter so you just uh, link to the layout and that's all okay so that's it. I'll see you in the m next video. Thank you for watching.